Hello, I'm Dr. Ann Ramsey, and on behalf of Mission College, I'd like to welcome you to our annual Women in Leadership Changing the World Awards. In 2024, we honor three remarkable women who have made contributions in their fields and in their communities. Today, we honor Susan Jen Davis. I realized early on in my career that I just kept kind of diverting a bit to doing work in what is now called diversity, equity, and inclusion. It wasn't called that then because I was always seeing spaces that weren't inclusive because I remember, I, I knew, I knew how that felt. I watched that all my life. So I was very, very kind of like looking for where I could open up spaces and where I can be kind of an advocate for inclusion and for justice and equity. Right. I just didn't know the words at the time. Valerie Landau. I've always been driven ever since I was very young by the idea that we could change the world, that we didn't have to live in the world that we were given, we could create a better world. And so that's always been a driving force of mine and always looking for how can we innovate, how can we change the thing that is blocking people from meeting their full potentially full potential, especially those who've not been included. And Pippa Malgram. I remember when I was quite young in my twenties, sitting down with a um, very, very prominent ambassador, American ambassador. And I remember he said, which part of the world do you want to specialize in? Are you going to be a Japan specialist or a Europe specialist, Latin America, Africa? And I remember thinking, why do I have to choose? We we live on Earth. And, and again, if you're working for the President of the United States or running a major global corporation, you don't have the luxury of picking one spot. You have to look at the whole darn thing. And I remember actually using that moment to say no. I'm not going to specialize. I am going to look at the world as one holistic thing. And that's that was very valuable, um, uh, very valuable lesson to learn. Congratulations.